On the clinical examination, you observe a small laxity of your lateral ligaments, and in the standing position, you have a malalignment of your hind foot. On the X-ray, we confirm that the malalignment comes from the supramalleolar area. We collect a lot of information with our clinical decision support system, for example, the quality of your life, the function of your ankle, localization of your pain. With all this data, we can reproduce your pathology by simulation. It's like a clone, which we can simulate and validate the best surgery for you. So we just received a medical imaging for a patient, and using CATI on the 3DX platform, we were able to recreate the 3D model of that specific patient. And that can be used for surgical simulation. Andrea, I see something interesting on the screen. Yes, actually, by using uh, Abacus within the 3DX platform, we have, done, uh, we have simulated the best surgical treatment for the patients. And you can see here the ground reaction force, the plantar pressure, the movement of the foot, and even a sagittal cut of the movement of the foot, where we can see actually that the movement of the ankle is perfectly consistent, and then the surgical treatment actually was a success. Cedric, I've just finished the simulation. I have the results here. Can you cap and see? Yeah, sure. Well, uh, we got the complete behavior of the foot from uh, his strike impact to toe off. Uh, everything is green, meaning that there is no mechanical stress, so I think we got a, a very nice dynamic simulation. Yeah. Okay, perfect. So let's go to the surgical part then. You will now go to the operating room. A supramaleolar osteotomy was performed. The aim of this procedure was to realign the article surfaces of your ankle in order to correct the malalignment of your hind foot. Let's now evaluate the effectiveness of the surgery with a gait analysis in order to check if the simulated results correspond to your actual reality. And do the results match with what 3D simulation predicted? Yes, let's have a closer look to these graphs. As you can observe, we have a perfect symmetry between the left and the right side. So the main objective of this procedure was achieved. So what you're saying basically is that the 3D virtual twin of the patient was quite useful for surgery. Yes, with this simulation technology, we were able to personalize your treatment in order to achieve long-term success. So what we can do maybe is wish that gentleman a happy walk. Yes, we can.